this is not a gift guide. Well, I mean, I guess it is a gift guide, but I don't want to call it a gift guide because I'm not a blogger. So this isn't a gift guide. This is cool things to get cool people that like cool things for Christmas or whatever holiday you are. Oh, hey, look who has decided to join us. It's Magui. Say hello. This is all stuff that I would want as a gift or stuff that I am gifting. A lot of small businesses. Um, yeah, I've been compiling this list for a while now, so I thought let's make a little video of cool stuff you could get cool people in your life who appreciate cool things and small businesses and all of that jazz. So, um, all right, let's get started with my gift guide. The first person we're going to talk about is Rebecca Miles. I'm pretty sure she sells in Nikki Kehoe, but if you go to her website, she has a ton of unique dishware, glasses, vases, and they're a little bit more on the pricey side, but if you have a friend or a family member that loves unique ceramic painted dishware, this could be a nice little splurge to add to their collection. Rebecca Miles. If you like really unique graphic tees, check out Do The Nile because they screen print all of their tees and they're just really unique. I feel like it's a really good gift for like a younger brother or just someone who loves a good graphic tee. Do The Nile. Okay, this is not a small business, but LOQ has the coolest dishware, objects, glassware. Like I love these wine glasses and they're not even that expensive so I feel like getting a pack of four or six of these for a friend as like a housewarming gift or even just like a good holiday gift in general and these really cool yellow bowls or like plate things uh, it, the prices are surprisingly not that bad for LOQ so if you have a friend that loves good wine get her some really unique wine glasses like these and then maybe grab a really nice bottle of wine to pair with it Voila, great gift. This is kind of a really small random gesture, but if you check out photofolio.com, you can send a postcard to anyone and they hand write it for you and it's like a really unique, cool postcard. I love this idea for a friend that maybe you haven't seen in a while. They hand write a postcard and send it to them and it's not that, ex it's $6. So if you have a friend that you wanna give a little gift to, but you don't wanna spend a ton of money, go check out Photofolio and send a handwritten postcard. Okay, now we're at this Etsy shop called Kutsurogu, and they have all of these Japanese paper shade lamps, and I am getting this little tomato one because I love tomatoes, but they have all these different fruits and vegetables, and they're just really cute, and they're battery powered, so you can put them wherever you want, bring them outside, I don't know. They're just like, they're only 45 bucks, cute little gift, cute little lamp, and again, if you're looking for something unique but affordable, Go check out this uh, Etsy website for people who would appreciate a nice Japanese paper lamp. I feel like I'm the only one who knows about So Far Sounds. So if you don't know what So Far Sounds is, it's basically this concert that you can get tickets to, but you don't know who's playing and you don't know where it is. They basically just tell you an area. So in Chicago, it'll be like, this concert is on December 15th in Lincoln Park and then that night they send you all of the details of where it is and you kind of bring your own your own wine it's BYOB and you get to experience new music that you might not have done before and it's just like a fun experience like just if you're looking for like a fun date night like why not and they have gift cards that you can give as a gift or it's just like book it for your significant other and go to one it's a good it's a good date night idea or just something to do with a friend that you haven't seen in a while. I found this site called Addyway Books. They have photography books, fashion books, poetry books, and they're all really nicely curated. So it's a lot of stuff I really haven't seen before that you can't find at like your local Barnes and Noble or whatever. So if you're looking for a unique coffee table book to get a friend, definitely check out this site, Addy, Addyway Books. Another gift I would personally love is a subscription to Apartmento Magazine. I love Apartmento Magazine. I love having magazines out on my coffee table again, and I've just never really gotten a subscription to one, and I, I'm definitely gonna pass this along to someone in my family who's looking to get me a nice affordable gift. I think a magazine subscription is so ideal, specifically Apartmento Magazine, because it's just such a fun magazine to maybe start collecting. Mom, Dad, if you're watching this, Teague, Jack, anybody? Unique 
florals are the perfect gift for anything. My good friend, Christiana Perry at Perry Florals, she was actually my roommate in Los Angeles for three years, is an amazing florist. And every year she offers holiday wreaths. And I think these ones are more dried out, so they last. If you go to her site, she's offering a really cool winter wreath for 125 bucks. You can use my code PAGEWASSEL for 10% off. She ships wherever you want. And I think this is a good little gift to send to someone before the holidays, obviously. It's a wreath. So if there's someone out there that you wanna just get a little gift over to them, you know, just saying, hey. She also sells apparel and does floral arrangements and dried arrangements. I use her for pretty much any time I have to send an arrangement for like a baby shower or whatever. She's my go-to. We've talked about this site before, Parlor. They're an online art kind of dealership website where you can buy pieces of art and pay them off on a monthly basis. But I wanted to quickly talk about their holiday subscription because it is an amazing gift for any art lovers. Basically, you can pay for a piece of art to rent in your family member or friend's home for one, three, or six months. And all of that money that you pay for the rental goes towards the piece if they decide to buy it. Parlor will email the person that you are gifting this to so they can select the art themselves, which is pretty nice because art is really specific. So I would personally want to pick it out than have someone pick it out for me, especially something at this high of price. And you can use my code PAGE10 for $10 off any subscription. I have a video coming out soon of like stuff I wear and my jewelry. I wouldn't consider myself a fashion person to take advice from, but sounds like a fun video to film. But anyways, Mondo Mondo has really unique jewelry. I think it's really fun to incorporate colors in rings and earrings and I like having unique earrings because if you're wearing like a plain shirt, throw on an earring and now you have a unique outfit. Go check out Mondo Mondo if you like unique rings and stuff with color. She has a lot of color and I am trying to incorporate more color into my wardrobe next year as I sit here wearing a black sweater. Crying Clover Candles have really cool candles that you will never wanna burn because you want them to sit out. But when I discovered this website, I was like, yes, any friend that has a birthday coming up, it's a little expensive, but again, if you have a friend that would really appreciate this, you know, buying them a $150 custom candle from Crying Clover Candles, you're not only supporting a small business, but you're also giving your friend a unique gift. I've mentioned in a past video that I really love Japanese dishware. I just love the materials they're made out of. And I found this site called Wing on Woe and Co. Wing on Woe and Co. And it's Japanese tableware. And it's a lot of ceramic colorful pieces. So again, I'm trying to be more colorful in my life. They have really cute little chopstick holders and they have Japanese spoons. It just has a ton of colorful Japanese ceramics and again, another small business. As you know, I do love Matilda Goad. We're gonna do a video on her soon, but I recently saw that she came out with these little oval frames. These are so cute. I personally love the pink and red little striped one. It's about 150 bucks, such a good frame such a good gift put a photo in there print something off it's just it's cute and simple a good little like holiday hostess gift if you will waldia and co has the coolest prints and they're only 40 bucks so the perfect price point if you want to buy a nice affordable print and then maybe thrift a frame it's just unique and different and i i want to i'm going to purchase one for one of my friends myself so i thought I would share with you. Now for Chicago. If you haven't heard of Cha Cha Club, it looks like it's Tax uh, Club, but it's Cha Cha Club. This is a basically a supper club. You pay 75 bucks and you go into this house, this uh, couple's house, and they make you a dinner that it's like six courses. It's three hours long. I did it with a few of my friends the other week and it was such a cool experience. You're just meeting other people. People are cooking for you. You're getting unique food and there's always a theme. So we went to the Chinese themed uh, dinner, which was not you know, what you would expect. Very unique and different. So if you live in Chicago, go check out Cha Cha Club. They put up their calendars, I think every month and it's all different cuisines and it's just a fun, cool experience. So I don't think they offer gift cards, but it could be something fun to plan with a friend or your significant other. Just a fun little date night around the holidays. 
you know? That Tiger Works is another small business to support out in Chicago. They offer really cool tees and sweatpants and hats. And again, Chicago-based, really cool. And they do a lot of different workshops and events. So they're just kind of a fun company to keep an eye out on and always are releasing really cool apparel. Chicago Over Everything is another Chicago-based company that offers hoodies and hats again. So if you're looking to shop local, check out Chicago Over Everything. Um, another Chicago small business to support. Joe Fresh Goods, another Chicago brand to support. Um, really cool t-shirts, posters, hats. Again, a lot of streetwear um, brands that I'm kind of shouting out here in Chicago. But if you know any other cool Chicago artists I should check out, leave them in the comments because I'm constantly looking for cool, creative people around Chicago. Thank you for watching and listening to my gift guide, my 2021 holiday gift guide by Paige Wassel. All right, Magoo, come say goodbye. Say goodbye to your friends. She needs a haircut because she can't see. Right? All right, that's all I got. Everything is linked down below, and any site that has a code is also down there, so go down there. And I'll also be featuring more uh, gift ideas on my Instagram, so go follow me on Wasselpa. I'll be posting throughout the month of, of stuff, just stuff and more stuff. <sighs> All right. Goodbye.